a sestina is a fixed verse form consisting of six stanzas of six lines each, normally followed by a three-line envoy. The words that end each line of the first stanza are used as line endings in each of the following stanzas, rotated in a set pattern. The invention of the form is usually attributed to 12th century troubadour Anor Daniel. After spreading to continental Europe, it first appeared in English in 1579, though sestinas were rarely written in Britain until the end of the 19th century. It remains a popular poetic form, and many continue to be written by contemporary poets. History The oldest known sestina is Lo Fan Volaquil Commentra, written around 1200 by Arnold Daniel, a troubadour of Aquitanian origin. He refers to it as Clédicet, meaning, more or less, interlock. Hence, Daniel is generally considered the form's inventor, though it has been suggested that he may only have innovated an already existing form. Nevertheless, two other original troubadouric sestinas are known, the best known being Eras, Pas fe mon bina struc by Golem Pira Casals de Calaus. There are also two contrafacta built on the same end words, the best known being Ben Gran Avaliza Intra by Bertrand de Bourne. These early sestinas were written in Old Occitan. The form started spilling into Italian with Dante in the 13th century. By the 15th, it was used in Portuguese by Lua S. de Carma Micronis. The involvement of Dante and Petrarch in establishing the Sestina form, together with the contributions of others in the country, account for its classification as an Italian verse form a Euro despite not originating there. The result was that the Sestina was re imported into France from Italy in the 16th century. Pontus de Chiard was the first poet to attempt the form in French, and the only one to do so prior to the 19th century. He introduced a partial rhyme scheme in his Sestina. Equals English equals, the first appearance of the Sestina in English print is Ye Wasteful Woods, comprising lines 151 a Euro 89 of the August Aglog in Edmund Spencer's Shepherd's Calendar, published in 1579. It is an unrhymed iambic pentameter, but the order of end words in each stanza is non standard a Euro ending 123,456. 612,345, etc. A euro each stanza promoting the previous final end word to the first line, but otherwise leaving the order intact. The envoy order is 2 4 6. This scheme was set by the Spaniard Gutierrez de Setina. Although they appeared in print later, Philip Sidney's three sestinas may have been written earlier, and are often credited as the first in English. The first published is the double sestina ye goat her gods. In this variant the standard end word pattern is repeated for twelve stanzas, ending with a three-line envoy, resulting in a poem of seventy-five lines. Two others were published in subsequent editions of the Arcadia. The second, since wailing is a bud of cause foul sorrow, is in the standard form. Like ye goat her gods it is written in unrhymed iambic pentameter and uses exclusively feminine endings, reflecting the Italian end casillabo. The third, Farewell, O Sun, Arcadia's clearest light, is the first rhyming sestina in English, it is in iambic pentameters and follows the standard end word scheme, but rhymes A B A B C C in the first stanza. Sidney uses the same envoy structure as Spencer. William Drummond of Hawthorne published two sestinas in 1616, which copy the form of Sidney's rhyming sestina. After this, there is an absence of notable sestinas for over 250 years, with John Frederick Nims noting that there is not a single sestina in the three volumes of the Oxford anthologies that cover the 17th, 18th and 19th centuries. In the 1870s, there was a revival of interest in French forms, led by Andrew Lang, Austin Dobson, Edmund Goss, W. E. Henley, John Payne, and others. The earliest sestina of this period is Algernon and Charles Swinburne's sestina. It is in iambic pentameter rhyming Ababab in the first stanza. Each stanza begins by repeating the previous end words six then one, but the following four lines repeat the remaining end words ad lib. The envoy is four slash three slash six. In the same volume Swinburne introduces a double sestina that is unlike Sidney's, it comprises twelve stanzas of twelve iambic pentameter lines each, the first stanza rhyming ab cubs feed. 
similar to his sestina, each stanza first repeats end words 12 then one of the previous stanza. The rest are ad lib. The envoy is 10 slash 9 slash 4 slash 6 slash 1 slash 5. From the 1930s, a revival of the form took place across the English-speaking world, led by poets such as W. H. Auden, and the 1950s were described as the age of the Sestina by James E. B. Bruslin. Sestina, Alter 40 by Ezra Pound and Paisage Moraleza Copyright by W. H. Auden are distinguished modern examples of the Sestina. The Sestina remains a popular closed verse form, and many Sestinas continue to be written by contemporary poets. Notable examples include The Guest Ellen at the Supper for Street People by David Ferry and IVF by Kona McPhee. Form Although the Sestina has been subject to many revisions throughout its development there remain several features that define the form. The Sestina is composed of six stanzas of six lines, followed by a stanza of three lines. There is no rhyme within the stanzas. Instead the sestina is structured through a recurrent pattern of the words that end each line, a technique known as lexical repetition. In the original form composed by Daniel, each line is of ten syllables, except the first of each stanza which are of seven. The established form, as developed by Petrarch and Dante, was in Hendka syllables. Since then, changes to the line length have been a relatively common variant, such that Stephen Burt has written, Sestinas, as the form exists today, do not require expertise with inherited meter. The pattern that the line ending words follow is often explained if the numbers 1 to 6 are allowed to stand for the end words of the first stanza. Each successive stanza takes its pattern based upon a bottom up pairing of the lines of the preceding stanza. Given that the pattern for the first stanza is 123,456, this produces 615,243 in the second stanza. Another way of visualizing the pattern of line ending words for each stanza is by the procedure known as retrogradatio cruciata, which may be rendered as backward crossing. The second stanza can be seen to have been formed from three sets of pairs, or two triads. The 1 a euro 2 a euro 3 triad appears in its original order but the 4 a euro 5 a euro 6 triad is reversed and superimposed upon it. The pattern of the line ending words in a sestina is represented both numerically and alphabetically in the following table. The sixth stanza is followed by a tercet that is known variably by the French term envoy, the Occitan term tornada, or, with reference to its size in relation to the preceding stanzas, a half stanza. It consists of three lines that include all six of the line endings words of the preceding stanzas. This should take the pattern of 2 a euro 5, 4 a euro 3, 6 a euro 1. The first end word of each pair can occur anywhere in the line, while the second must end the line. However, the end word order of the envoy is no longer strictly enforced. The sestina has been subject to some variations, with changes being made to both the size and number of stanzas and also to individual line length. A double sestina is the name given to either, two sets of six six-line stanzas, with a three-line envoy, or twelve twelve-line stanzas, with a six-line envoy. Examples of either variation are rare. Ye Goat Herd Gods by Philip Sidney is a notable example of the form of variation, while the complaint of Lisa by Algen and Charles Swinburne is a notable example of the latter variation. In the form of variation, the original pattern of line ending words, that is that of the first stanza, recurs in the seventh stanza, and thus the entire change of pattern occurs twice throughout. In the second variation, the pattern of line ending words returns to the starting sequence in the eleventh stanza. Thus it does not, unlike the single sestina, allow for every end word to occupy each of the stanza ends. End words 5 and 10 fail to couple between stanzas. A tritona is a contraction of the sestina to three stanzas of three lines, with a one-line envoy. The order of the line ending words follows the same pattern as that of the sestina, so that they appear, 123, 312, 231 with the envoy is 123. Effect The structure of the sestina, which demands adherence to a strict and arbitrary order, produces several effects within a poem. Stephen Burt notes that, the sestina has served, historically, as a complaint, 
its harsh demands acting as signs for deprivation or duress. The structure can enhance the subject matter that it orders. In reference to Elizabeth Bishop's A Miracle for Breakfast, David Kaplan suggests that the form's harshly arbitrary demands echo its subjects. Nevertheless, the form's structure has been criticized. Paul Fussell considers the Sestina to be of dubious structural expressiveness, when composed in English and, irrespective of how it is used, would seem to be, a form that gives more structural pleasure to the contriver than to the apprehender. Margaret Spinoz highlights a number of corresponding levels of tension and resolution resulting from this structural form, including, structural, semantic and aesthetic tensions. She believes that the aesthetic tension, which results from the conception of its mathematical completeness and perfection, set against the experiences of its labyrinthine complexities can be resolved in the apprehension of the harmony of the whole. The strength of the Sestina, according to Stephen Ferry, is the repetition and recycling of elusive patterns that cannot be quite held in the mind all at once. For Shanna Compton, these patterns are easily discernible by the newcomers to the form. She says that, even someone unfamiliar with the form's rules can tell by the end of the second stanza. What's going on? See also, Villanel, another type of fixed verse form. Cans one, an Italian or Provena section El Song or Ballad, in which the Sestina is sometimes included. Pentina, a variation of the Sestina based on five end words. Notes. References. Further reading. External links. Academy of American Poets, The Sestina Form and Examples, Max Weenie's Internet Tendency, Selection of Sestinas from 2003 Euro 2007, Poetry Archive, The Form and Examples, University of Toronto, The Form and Examples, The Earliest Known Sestina.